Hey everybody, today I'm going to be showing you the Aris SB8200 surfboard. A lot of internet service providers now are starting to upgrade their internet speeds. And once you get up over probably 100, 100 to 200 megabits per second, you are most likely going to need to upgrade your modem. Now a lot of the places will let you rent a modem for like 10 bucks a month or something, but I would rather just purchase one outright and save that monthly fee. So my internet is going to be upgraded from 100 megabits per second currently to 400. And because of that, my current modem that I have is a Motorola Surfboard 6141. And that one's only capable of a max of I think 350, something like that, 350 megabits per second. So I needed to upgrade my modem. So I went with this one. Uh, it got some good reviews. This has DOCSIS 3.1 technology as opposed to 3.0, which allows it uh, to get significantly faster speeds, 10 times faster it says. Uh, it's got two one gigabit ethernet ports, two year warranty. It's backwards compatible with uh, DOCSIS 3.0. And it says it's ideal for gigabit internet packages offered by cable providers. Uh, I believe that this will be compatible with most cable providers. You're going to want to check just to be sure to make sure that it works with yours. Here it's got a comparison. So here's my Surfboard 6141 and compared to this. So it's downstream and upstream channels. It was 8 by 4 now it's 32 by 8 which is a major difference. Uh, this had one port. This had, The new one has two. Uh, one star for 4K. HD video streaming as opposed to five stars. Same thing with uh, HD multimedia streaming, five stars for the SB8200 as opposed to two and a half for my old surfboard. Um, same thing, online gaming, way more stars. So uh, let's check it out. It says it's future proof for your network for a while anyway. So here's what you get inside. Surfboard extreme speed cable modem. Here's the instructions right in the inside of the lid of the box. Just plug it in, get your cable, coax cable right there, ethernet connection to two different devices, and you're off. It's just that easy. One of these will most likely go to your router, and the other will go to maybe your main computer or whatever you want to hook that up to, if you want. And as far as looks, in the front, Looks like a regular modem, pretty much like my old Motorola modem, except it's got two ethernet cable locations in the back. If you're gonna upgrade your internet to a really fast speed, probably over 200 megabits per second, you're gonna want a DOCSIS 3.1 modem like this. There's other ones out there too. This one costs about, uh, I wanna say 175, $180. All right, thanks.